my life was only about gaming, especially towards the end. I was gaming probably 10 hours a day at least. Sometimes it was 2 a.m., but there have been times that it was until 6 in the morning. I stopped with all of my education, and basically all I did all day was game as much as I could, as much as my parents would allow. Uh, I just had like a really big fight with my parents because, of course, I wanted to game and they wouldn't let me. So I just went into the backyard and threw with stuff, and they were so angry. Uh, they just said, either you're going uh, out of the house, or are you going to Yes We Can? So I went to Yes We Can. When Bram came in, I saw a fellow that was very disconnected, eager and willing to, to get connected, but didn't have a clue how to. The only way he was able to connect was through his computer, yeah, and not knowing how to interact and connect in a normal way anymore. I think my role was to uh, mostly just be there um, and help him just try things out get out of his comfort zone, get out of his head, start to feel, start to experience, and just, just do it. I have a letter for you. Really? Here you go. Aww. Dear Paula, 10 months ago I didn't even know you, and yet I've learned so much from you. For 10 weeks I put my trust in you and I got so much more in return. You were always willing to be a listening ear. <laughs> I learned that it's okay to make mistakes and it's okay to be me. In fact, it's great to be me. You also gave me the love that I thought I was missing, but now I realize that it's not so different from the love my family gives me. <laughs> really beautiful. To you, I owe my positive spirit and I hope you can create many more and do for others what you did for me. I'm now almost six months along my journey of recovery and I'll make sure it won't be the end. I'm glad you're part of that journey. Thanks for everything. Wow. <laughs> Come here. Thank you very much. <laughs> Such a surprise. <laughs> really nice. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah. I'm really uh, grateful for it. Yeah, I'm really surprised. And uh, yeah, I'm just really happy to see you again and uh, glad to be part of your journey. I think what I uh, really like about Bram is um, there's a part of him that is really smart and intelligent and uh, a real adult who likes to talk all about mathematics and uh, politics and all this stuff. But there's also a part that is still a little child and likes to jump on the bed and make silly jokes and now he knows how to find the right balance in it. And, uh, but that's what I really love to see, that, uh, yeah, that you have these two sides in you. So it's uh, like half a year after the treatment now and uh, I still go to uh, three meetings per week. And I go there, well, willingly. I really enjoy being there and just connecting with other fellows, being able to say whatever I want to. Just, uh, I guess, empty my mind. I think Bram's biggest challenge is to, uh, to stay connected with the people around him, with daily life, with structure. Um, he will be able to um, yeah, not go back into gaming again. What Yes We Can did to my life was, uh, well, first of all, I stopped gaming, of course. Um, and I have a much better connection with my family now. I learned uh, a lot of social skills. And uh, now I even have a job, which I never would have had uh, while still in my addiction. Life's really good now. Uh, I'm not depressed anymore every day. I can just wake up happy and uh, go to work or do things with my brother or anything.